Hey everyone, I'm Steve Severs from Bionic Buzz. Welcome to the Set Decorated Society of America International 25th Anniversary Gala here at Universal Studios Sheraton. And if you're like me, you're passionate about film and TV, some of the unsung heroes are set decorators. Let's see who we can talk to on the red carpet here tonight. All right, ladies, what brings you out here tonight? I'm a set decorator and I've been a member of the SDSA for a long time, since like 2003. Nice. And you? I'm also a set decorator and an assistant set decorator. I do both. And uh, I've also been part of the SDSA since I was a student member wow. 10 years ago. Um, and so we're here because this is our big event. And, and so we're here and we're dressed up. The shine. So here at Bionic Buzz, we're all about people's passion. Where'd your passion for filmmaking come from? Certain performance you saw as a kid, or you know, made you want to get into it. You know, I was an extra on a movie called Tin Cup. Oh, really? And I got to uh, see the sets. I got a tour because I knew the editor of a magazine I was working for, and uh, I was like, "Wait, what? There's this thing called set decoration? Tell me more!" And that was it. I was hooked. That's so, so cool. I, yeah. And what and about you? Were you an extra? <laughs> I was not an extra. So I grew up in Orange County, nice. and um, so I was kind of. LA light mm -hmm. um, and I had a I had a uh, uncle who was a production manager oh. and then uh, but before any of that happened I would and I'm an only child so I played with myself and my dolls and things <laughs> and uh, she played with her dolls I played with my dolls and uh, I would make sets in my room oh, so it'd be like cool. this is now we're playing at the Hamptons or now I'm making a store and I would like my room would become sets and playscapes and so I did it since I was a kid and then kind of similar I showed up to a set and saw a bedroom that looked exactly like a bedroom and it was like oh I was on a sound I was outside now I'm inside but I'm inside outside it was just like kind of a mind blow you know like just wow this is a thing that actually happens and I could do this for a living so kind of similar. I love it, and someone who's very passionate about film and TV, like myself, I feel like the set designers are the true heroes. What yeah, have you guys? Decorator. Set, decorators. set decorators. I screwed we up. We talked about this earlier. <laughs> I've been coaching you. Not the problem is, long. like, I always you say graphic designer. Listen. You never listen. <laughs> <laughs> Just okay, my set decorators. <laughs> my family is always like, oh, you're a set director. Love it. I'm like, yeah, that's what I do. Yeah, exactly. By tonight, I'll get it right. So, yeah. Set Decorators Society of America. So, yeah. you guys are set decorators. Yeah, I know you're about to close off, but I just want to give a shout out to this little Jenny here. Yeah. who is my buyer and I went on to another show and I was working and I um, got offered a show a little show called Silicon Valley that wow. Jenny took over and nice. next thing you know she's got a freaking Emmy and I'm so proud of her so. very cool well that's what I was gonna ask what uh what work have you done this is your moment to shine what, what, what shows uh, have you worked on? A lot. Huh? Yeah. yeah. yeah I think IMDb said, I just looked yesterday, 47 credits or something wow, crazy. Oh, my God. That's too much work. I work a lot. <laughs> I um, I don't know. I'm currently working on a show called uh, Hit the Floor, but a show called Love's coming out in a couple weeks on mm -hmm. Netflix. Uh, I, did, I did a show called Splitting Up Together that's coming out at the end of March. Hit the floors coming out this summer. I don't know. Work, work, work. What are you doing, Jenny? Nice, yeah. So I did a little show called Silicon Valley mm -hmm. for three years. <laughs> the littlest big show in town. Um, that was my first set decorating gig because I've only been a decorator for four years. Wow. So I did that. It's my very first gig, and it was the hardest and most rewarding and best worst time of my whole life. So did that, and that was my big show. And then I did a few pilots. Right now I'm working on a new procedural called The Rookie. Mm -hmm. So it'll come out at some point in time. Very cool. Where can we stay up to date, follow your journey on social media? Are you on, social media? on Instagram, I'm B Woke, W-O-O-K-E, and uh, Beth Woke. Uh, I don't know. I think it's Facebook. I don't know if I'm public or not. <laughs> it might be a point. Yeah. Oh, IMDb, yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> we'll look up all your credits on it. So I can plug my side hustle. Can I plug my yes. side hustle? Okay. So my side hustle is at Funky Form and Function, nice. where I sell all of the thrift store jewelry that I collect that I can't that's so cool. Wear anymore, because yeah. I have too much of it. Very cool. All right. Well, thank you, ladies, so much. I'm Jenny Mueller. Robbins. It's fine. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody. <laughs>